Hi, my name is Christy Sampson and welcome to this week's Ask Christy. When we were talking to my husband last week, I was thinking about how some of the things that we do um, normally for our tech people to prepare them, not everybody might be doing. Uh, maybe we take it for granted. So some of you probably already do this, but I wanted to cover it just in case not everyone's doing it. So I make a script for everyone that has some sort of tech job related to the show. And I'm very detailed in writing in the script. I don't just give them a script and hope that they do it right, which sometimes we do. Because it seems like common sense that if somebody has a solo in a song, they're going to turn it on. But I make sure that I, that I write it all out. So for if the sound people that work on the microphones, I'll write down if you have different countryman mics, um, lapel mics, something like that. I'll label them. Number one is this character. Number two is this character. And then I'll actually write at the top of the scene numbers one, three, and seven on. Um, and then down here, one, three, and seven off. Turn on three. I'll write it throughout the whole script. Now, our, our tech people can do a lot of that, obviously, but this will save time if you do it for them. And plus, you can ensure that you really get it done the way that you want it to be done. And I think they'll be very grateful because then they don't have to put in all that extra work. So write, you know, anything like that. Circle it in the middle of the song. You know, narrators one and two have a line. They're going to be standing at these mics. Make sure those two mics are on. Uh, super detailed, and I write one for each person. So that sound person that's doing mics will have this script. Then the sound person with the cues, that's a whole different thing. This is sound cue number 42. However you do it, they would have their own book. Then if you have a spotlight, or if you have a spotlight, you would write that all spot on, spot off on these lines, everything like that. Or if you just want to turn the lights if you want to dim them after a scene, maybe the house lights, um, 10 seconds, you could just write 10 seconds to dim lights right here. Um, just, you know, it's always better, I think, to give more information um, than less information. Because when we assume things, then things don't go the way we want them to. But if we just give everybody, if we get everybody on the same page, it's a whole lot easier. So backstage, I do the same thing with props, costumes. Um, you know, when they should start putting the costume on this person, how long we have, things like that. Uh, just give everybody all the information as early as possible and that everybody will feel free to do a great job.